So in this video we're going to look at pitting corrosion on stainless steel using hot ferric chloride solution. And this is the stock bottle of ferric chloride which is a dark grey powder, iron 3 chloride, which is 97% pure, made by Sigma Oldridge. So now I'm going to weigh some of this out on this filter paper, which is on the balance here. So I'm taking the top off the bottle, I'm just taking a regular spoon, I'm going to start getting some out. There we go. You see it's a dark brown powder. That's six grams. A bit more. Okay, that's ten grams, a little bit more. It needs to be quite strong to do this. I'll make it up, I'll take it up to about twenty grams. There, that's 21.52 grams. So that's the ferric chloride weighed out. I'm going to put the lid back on now. So this reacts quite strongly with water. So I'm going to pick this up now. So 21.51 grams of ferric chloride. You can have a closer look. So that's the ferric chloride powder. It's going into the beaker here like this. Put as much in as we can. Okay, put that back there. So now we're going to add some water to this. So here we have the bottle of water. This is just regular distilled water, one litre of it. And I'm going to pour that in to about halfway. There we go, you can see it's going brown straight away. I'm going to take about 150, that's enough. I'm going to take a glass spatula, glass rod to be precise. I'm going to stir that around, we need to dissolve all of that. So you can see it's brown in colour. Okay, let's see the colour. I'm now going to turn the hot plate on. Okay, let's leave that in there. And here's this piece of stainless steel. So I've cut this off a piece of sheet using some uh, hand cutters. It's just a piece of regular stainless steel, type 304. And I've just roughly abraded it, so it's clean, but it's not in any way affected. It's a flat piece of steel, in other words. Stainless steel. So that's just going to go in there. I'm going to take out the spatula. So now what we're going to do is going to heat that up to almost boiling point, and we're going to leave it for several hours, and then we'll come back in a second video to look at the effect of the ferric chloride and the formation of pits.